it's time for more announcements. We have Eureka's September announcements now. So let's dive in and have a look at these. I've not really had too much of a look, uh, just a cursory glance, but let's have a, a proper dig in here. First up, we have the champions starring Yun Biao. I'm always happy to see more Yun Biao. This looks like a kind of, uh, kind of fun Shaolin soccer type of thing. We've got a sports action comedy collide in Golden Harvest, the champions, the precursor to Shaolin soccer and the first family of Hong Kong martial arts cinema, the imitable Yun clan. Lee Tong is a young farmer who's grown up in an isolated rural community. When an indiscretion lands him in hot water, he leaves his home in the countryside and heads for the big city, where he meets Sun, a street footballer who recognises Tong's talent for the beautiful game and encourages him to try out for a pro team. But Tong's first chance of footballing glory is scuppered by a rivalry with a narcissistic king who relegates the newcomer to cleaning up after his teammates. But having discovered the love for football, Tong soon accepts an offer to join a rival team and the stage is set for a final confrontation with King on the pitch. I mean, you can almost imagine the entire story there. That doesn't really matter if the action uh, in the story is pretty fun. You get a limited edition O-Car slipcase, You've got a 1080p presentation from a brand new 2K scan. We have the original Cantonese audio and a, a optional English dub tracks. We have English subtitles, which are newly translated for this release. We've got a new commentary by Frank Jeng and FJ DeSanto. A new commentary by Mike Leader and Arn Vinema. And we've got a brand new interview with filmmaker James Mudge. Brand new featurette by CFK looking at 1987 Hong Kong celebrity football soccer team that featured a number of Hong Kong legends including Jackie Chan and Andy Lau. Reversible sleeve, trailer and limited edition booklet. Now, I'm willing to give this a shot. It looks or it sounds kind of fun. The story sounds very tropey. I don't mind that, you know, as long as it's engaging fun and has some good action which you know, we'll give a shot. Next up we have two Taoist tales. Uh, Taoism Drunkard and the Young Taoism Fighter. Are these the sequels to the Miracle Fighters? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh, in the week of Encounter of the Spooky Kind, the Hong Kong film industry launched headlong into a prolific genre cycle that drew upon Taoist folklore. Popular throughout the 80s and into the next decade, these films combined elements of horror, fantasy, comedy and martial arts as they pit their protagonists against hopping vampires, vengeful ghosts and evil sorcerers. Here, Eureka Classics is proud to present two of the most mind-bending tales of Taoist magic ever committed to film, Taoism Drunkard and Young Taoism Fighter. Directed by and starring Yun Chin Yan, Taoism Drunkard follows the man with a love for wine who accidentally damages a sacred statue. To atone for this blunder, he is asked by an enraged Taoist priest to find a virginal boy to aid in defending his temple from a demonic sorcerer. Then, in Young Taoism Fighter, a practitioner of Taoist Kung Fu manages to separate his soul from his body before teaming up with the vengeful young woman to take on a sinister sorcerer, an evil leader of a rival Kung Fu school. So we have a limited edition Okar slipcase. The set includes both films, and they're both presented in 1080p from new 2K restorations. Original Cantonese audio and optional English dub tracks. English subtitles newly translated for this release. We've got a new commentary by Frank Jeng on both films, a new commentary by Mike Leader and Arn Vina on both films. You've got a new interview with the director and actor Yun Chin Yang, brand new interview with filmmaker James Mudge, a limited edition booklet, and the extras are subject to change now. 
you know, and, and counter this book again, in that vein of movies that came out as something that I really enjoyed, the Mr. Vampire series, the medical fighters, which I, I thought this was sequels to, but it may not be. Um, I'm interested. They're usually batshit crazy, lots of fun, just chaos and mayhem going on. I, I'm down for that. So I'm interested in checking out these two. And I would say the most exciting release uh, this month is the Louis Fuad, uh, the complete crime series from 1913 to 1980. It's a limited edition set Blu-ray from Eureka. It's Masters of Cinema, taking us from numbers 296 up to 299, almost at that magical 300. It is a pricey endeavour. It's released in the 30th of the 9th. And, uh, you know, without reading anything else, so I am in. That looks amazing. Uh, I love the idea of these serials from that time span. I want to see them. An early cinematic pioneer with undeniable pervasive influence, Louis Fiedad made hundreds of films in a short career spanning only a few decades. Today, he is best remembered for his landmark serials, Fatimas, Le Vampire, Judo, and Tien four crime epics that have a measurable impact on pop culture around the globe. The Masters of Cinema series is honoured to present these silent masterworks on Blu-ray for the first time in the UK. From astonishing 4K restorations, ooh, 4K restorations of these as well, fantastic. Adapted from a series of popular novels by Marseille, Alain and Pere Silvestri, Phantoms stars René Navarra as the eponymous criminal mastermind. Across the series' five episodes, Phantomas is pursued by Inspector Rouvet and newspaper reporter Jérôme Fandor as he carries out his nefarious schemes. In Le Vampire, journalist Philippe Gourand attempts to investigate an enigmatic crime gang operating in the Parisian underworld, a group known only as the Vampires. In Judo, a mysterious vigilante sets out to bring down a corrupt banker named Farlo. Finally, in T. Ming, a young man, returning from an expedition in Indochina, becomes embroiled in a game of espionage at Navery with a gang of mysterious jewel thieves. Fuyad's crime serials had an enormous impact on some of the greatest filmmakers of the 20th century, chiefly Fritz Lang and Alfred Hitchcock. They also played an important role in the development of the criminal mastermind and master vigilante characters that would proliferate in pulp magazines, film, television, radio and comic books over the next few decades, including Dr. Mabuse, The Shadow, Diabolique. Few lads, celebrated serials are here collected in their entirety, along with a wealth of special features. This is a limited edition hard box, 2,000 copies, the set includes all four serials across 10 Blu-ray discs presented in 1080p HD from a stunning 4K restoration, uncompressed 2.0 audio in all serials, including scores by Mont Alto, Motion Picture Orchestra and Patrick Laviosa, brand new audio commentaries on select serial chapters, brand new interviews with film critics and historians, a collector's booklet featuring new archival writing on Fiat and the serials included in the set. More to be confirmed, and the extras are subject to change. Ten discs. Uh, I wonder what the length of this is going to be. That sounds incredible. It's a, a huge release, I would say, for Eureka, and goes back to why I love them as much as I do. For releasing things like this, never heard of it. It's instantly got my excitement right up there and is something I cannot wait to delve into. When do I have to wait? 30th of September. Can we just get there already? Fantastic. I'm sold on this. I'm going to watch Champions. I will watch the two Taoist tales and I will enjoy them. But this set, I've got a feeling, is going to be something special. Now, I would love to know if you've seen any of these movies. If you've uh, already dipped your toe into Louis Fuyad's stuff or you know more about him, then please let me know in the comment box below because I want to know more. I want to get that excitement really pumping for this release. I cannot wait. Let me know 
If there's anything here that really gets you excited, if there's anything that you're going to pick up, let me know in the comment box below. As always, there is more content up here. You can see more of my stuff. In the description box below are links to Patreon, membership program, and the manvfilm.com. Always in which you can support me. Can't wait for September to get here. Thanks for watching. See you next time.